From Western Stanford, I'm a 205 competitor with a 200 Evinrude with DPS steering on the back. We got a big Shorelander trailer underneath with tall load guides and a spare tire swing tongue. Standard at Westry's. Um, we're about to get after it. Hang around. We got this one paired with the 200 Evinrude on it. Uh, comes with the DPS steering. DPS steering stands for Digital Power Steering. Um, what that's going to do is when you take off, it's going to give you a ton of hole shot and it's going to auto trim up to you so you're getting on plane as quick as possible. Along with that, uh, Evinrude is one of the most fuel efficient motors on it. Don't got to worry about putting oil in all the time. It's about every 40 hours. It's a real nice oil, um, synthetic, so it doesn't burn through the motor real quick. Right here we got a live well um, with the bait bucket on this side. So you got a ginormous live well if you're out there catching muskies, pike. Um, even some of our guys in here are catching those big walleyes, and that's perfect size for that. Um, there's a secondary live well that I use for bait in mine that I can show you. Storage, if you ever get an additional battery, we can put a knob on it. Battery's here for your power steering. On this side, you got a cooler. It's perfect for worms, grubs, all that kind of stuff. No fur fact, it holds about 24 cans in there um, for those guys interested in that. Uh, we'll have Aggie move to the other side of the boat here. Perfect rod storage for them big musky rods, pike rods, fits all the way up here. You can get 10 footers in there. Um, pretty much whatever you want to do uh, gives you all the options for that. The other nice thing I like about this, you got a fish on here, you got all the space to walk around on here as well in the cockpit so you can get to the edge of the boat, pick up them fish real easily. Boat comes with three air ride seats on it. Um, real nice, gives you some pressure when you're hitting them big waves. We'll move up to the front here. You got nice big rod storage in here. Fit about 10 rods, max up to eight. Fit some eight and a half in there. This is your secondary live well. This is the one I'm using mainly for um, bait and stuff. The other thing is if you're out there catching pike, later on in the day you wanna go get that walleye bite, it's nice to keep that separate. Dry storage on this side. Um, another option, you could use that as a secondary cooler if you wanted. Keep nice things nice and dry, or your wet life jackets, those can drain out in there. And then you got two giant storages up front. The other nice thing is they got these um, arms on here, so you've got easy access. It helps assist with it, pops right up. Fit two seats up here at one, but this is a ton of space. I stretch my arms out. I can't even reach both sides on it. So you can have three, four guys um, in the boat with plenty of space to fish. We got this one kind of pro teamed out, Helix 9, Helix 7. Um, everything's linked on it. They all tear us, self-deploy. Look like a genius out there. If you guys get some time, um, we got plenty of it here. So stop on by and check it out. Thanks.